just had some fun doing my thing, racing, going 25 miles an hour, living life on the edge. Oh my gosh, it feels so good to be back. Ah, freaking love the sound of this bike and the way I get to ride it. Not liking this five o'clock freaking traffic. But hey, anyway, I'm back. And when I say back, I mean that in the sense that my, t my front tire blew out last week. And um, I was going on the highway. I wish I had video of it. I didn't get it on, on camera, but going 75 on the freaking freeway, 12 o'clock at night, midnight, I feel the steering get super heavy. And I was like, this, this can't be normal, you know? Um, but like, I couldn't turn at all, and it was kind of scary. I was going 70 freaking five miles an hour, and I couldn't turn, and there was a, cur a turn coming up. And, uh, and so I thought, That's, this is not good. So I merged to the left lane, trying to get into the shoulder, and, uh, and as I slowed down, um, got under 30 miles an hour or so, the steering just started wobbling. It was like wobbling like crazy. I thought for sure I was going to drop the bike, but I was level headed enough and uh, kept it upright. I am so glad, so freaking glad that I didn't drop my bike that day. That would have just effed up like everything. Oh, is that a cop on a gold wing? How often do you see that, dude? Not very often. Anyway, but anyway, that's what I mean when I say back. Yesterday, I uh, got it repaired at Clausen of Fresno, Clausen Motorsports. They did the repair for $24, so can't really complain. Uh, I mean, all things considered, man, I didn't drop my bike, didn't get hurt, and it was only $24 to get back on the road. Hallelujah. Holla freaking luya. Uh, but, but yeah, man, it feels so good to be back on two wheels. Oh my god. Freaking love it, dude. But anyway, that and in one of my previous videos about the flasher relay on the Yamaha FZ6, um, I mentioned at the end that I'm going on vacation. I think this is my street. Nah, dude. Uh, but anyway, I mentioned that I was going on vacation. Uh, vacation is more of a business trip um, for two weeks. So yeah, man, I've kind of been out of the riding game. Kind of been out of the riding game for a little bit. Um, and I do like to keep my videos current. I try not to edit old videos if I can. Um, so yeah, man. But I've just been posting some stuff, some cafe racer builds and whatnot that I already had edited, or already had footage of. Um, so I've been releasing those slowly as I was on my trip. The trip was super freaking fun. Like, here's a couple photos for you. It's like, so freaking fun. Um, I went to Oklahoma, Dallas, uh, Dallas, Texas, then up to Oklahoma for a while to hang out with some of my cousins. Um, right, let's take this down, hold on. My brother was speaking at a conference. He did a freaking fabulous job, I'm not even kidding you. Of all the speakers there, it's a, it was an elite conference, $1,000 entry fee. He freaking killed it, dude. Of everybody who spoke, I felt like he was the most credible one there, um, but that's beside the point. So I came as his, his photographer, took some photos of him, um, but so that's pretty much why we went on the trip. He got selected to speak at a big conference, and I said, hey, why not, let's go to Dallas. So we did. And while we were over in that area, uh, we just went to Oklahoma and visited my cousins. So yeah, man, now that my bike is fixed, oh my gosh, I am just riding and having such a great time. <laughs> in, in Dallas and in Oklahoma, um, the weather was freaking cold, dude. It was like, I don't know, it was like 45 degrees, all right? That doesn't sound too bad, but it was windy the entire time. In Dallas and Oklahoma, the wind just does not stop. I don't know what it is, uh, but <laughs> but the wind chill, it was like 20 some degrees, and so it was freaking cold. So I got back here to Cali, and it was 75 sunny with no wind, and I was like, what is life, dude? So yeah, man, 
I'm just honestly enjoying today. This is the first time I've been riding since I uh, since I got back. For for like the last two and a half weeks since my tire blew before my trip. So yeah, man. Oh, it feels so good. Um, anyway, man, I'm just too pumped on life right now. So I'm actually just headed somewhere that I don't need to go to, but I kind of just want to ride. So that's where I'm headed to. <laughs> Um, yeah, man. Let's see, what else? On another note, I just want to give a quick shout out to the dude uh, that was sitting behind me at Starbucks yesterday. <laughs> Freaking upload the video to get a comment, like, within the first, like, 15 seconds. Like, I'm, a, I'm behind the guy at Starbucks making this video right now. <laughs> Super funny, dude. Made my day. I was kind of short on time, though. I was uh, trying to get home to actually install my wheel. My wheel was literally in my back seat when I was heading out, so I didn't really get any time to talk to you. But I really appreciate that, man. So, all right, guys. Well, I really hope you guys enjoyed the video today. I'm back at it with the Clovis PD. And uh, yeah, man. The freak is this hair doing on my bike? So, adios. Have a good one. It's gonna go get some work done, whatnot. So, oh shoot, that guy's good looking. All right, goodbye.